Hello everyone, welcome to the first Thailand vlog. Um, I'm not in Thailand currently, I'm still in the UK, very much in the UK, in a premiere inn. Um, I'm at the one next to Heathrow Airport and I stayed here last night. It is currently half past eight. I'm getting picked up to go to the airport at 9.40, so I've got like an hour still. And I'm pretty much ready. I'm not putting any makeup or anything on today because I just feel like for all of the traveling and stuff, I just don't want to mess up my skin and like have to think about cleansing my face and stuff. So yeah, I'm going for the no makeup look. Ow, that's my phone going off. Um, I feel pretty rough this morning. I'm not going to lie. I've woken up and I've started my period. So I don't feel great. I've got awful pains. I had a really bad headache last night. I feel a bit sick. I think it's probably nerves as well. Um... But yeah, welcome to the first vlog. I I am feeling excited, but I'm also trying not to think about what I'm actually doing because if I then start to think about it, then I start to panic and I get emotional and I feel like I'm just going to have like a freak out. So I'm just trying not to think about it and it's working so far. Um, but anyway, I've just headed downstairs to Costa in the hotel. They have a Costa downstairs. I've just gone and got a coffee. Um, very expensive mind. This was like almost five pounds. It's meant to be a flat white. It's massive so I don't really understand that. Um, but I needed a coffee, I needed something and yeah like I said I've still got an hour until I have to like leave to go to the airport so I don't really know what to do with myself because I'm trying to just like stay busy but also I've done everything. I do need to repack up my case because this is what, well not my case, my rucksack because this is what it currently looks like. Um, I obviously did have it all packed yesterday but I had to unpack everything to like get all of my pyjamas and stuff out last night so I do need to repack all of these bits. I thought I would quickly show you my outfit as well, it is nothing special, like absolutely nothing special but I just wanted to be comfy and chilled. Um, I've got quite a few layers on so that I could pack less clothes um, but anyway I've got these blue stripy trousers on which I love they're just so comfy I've got white trainers I've then got like a little um I've actually got like <laughs> a lot of things I've got a white like sports bra crop top thing then I've got a grey one then I've got this red like cozy comfy loose fitted jumper and then I'm also going to be wearing this hoodie over the top which is my gals who travel hoodie I am so excited to wear it I literally live in it at the moment um, so that's going to be cozy for the plane and then with my hair I've just I was going to have it down um, and I've put like little I've put little plaits in it but I don't know if I'm feeling it down so I did put it up in a ponytail but I don't know I'm going to flicker between the two I think um, so yeah I'm going to try and entertain myself for the next hour and then we will head to the airport and I'm going to try and vlog as much as I possibly can this trip. So yeah, let's do something crazy. This is so bizarre. I'm talking quietly because even though there's no one in here, it just feels weird. Um, but I'm all checked in and I've gone through security. It was actually fine. Like it was a really smooth process. Um, it was weird dropping off my bag. Like I like said goodbye to it and I was like, Will I ever see you again? Who knows? And I've got ages till my flight, like literally ages. Um, so I'm just gonna try and switch off. I feel very like flustered and I'm like a bit shaky because it's just a lot. Um, but yeah, I'm just gonna chill and read my book maybe. And just watch the planes. Like this is my view right now. It is crazy. Like I can literally just see all of the planes like taking off. So yeah, that is my current situation. Also, funny story. The woman asked me um, how old I was. Like I like walked over to her and I was like, "Is this the Emirates Lounge?" Because I'm flying with Emirates. I was like, "Is this the Emirates Lounge?" And she was like, "Yeah." Can I just ask how old you are? And I was like, and I panicked. I was like, "I'm um, 26." Literally. And then she was like, "Oh, you don't look it." I was like, "Yep." Yeah. I know. And then I started to go red and I haven't got any makeup on and I was like, oh god. But anyway, I'm here now and I'm going to chill. I might get a drink. Almost landed in Dubai. 
then I've got to wait for two hours to get my next one. I just want to go see it. It's been a very good flight. Right guys, excuse the absolute state of me. I've had no sleep in the last like, well, day, two days, whatever you wanna call it. Um, I finally arrived, I'm here. I haven't met the girl that I'm sharing a room with yet, but yeah, I barely filmed anything on the way here. Um, and then landed in Phuket Airport and met another girl who's on the trip called Matilda and we traveled to the hotel together so I've already met her and she's really nice she's gone to check into her room I've just checked into mine I'm sharing with a girl called Alice but I think I've been told she's down by the pool at the moment but I'm gonna give you a very quick little room tour before I need to like connect my phone to the wi-fi and stuff so I can message the girls and let them know I'm here but before anyone else comes in this room I'm just gonna show you a quick little little view um so you walk in we've got the bathroom here little mirror on here, got my little cycling shorts on because it is absolutely boiling. And then we've got two lovely beds, we've got some wardrobes, and then I haven't actually been out here yet, but we've got balcony! <laughs> Literally. Oh god, I don't am I gonna be able to open this? <gasps> yes. Oh my god. <gasps> and there's the pool. How beautiful. Oh my god, this is absolutely mad. Look at this view. What the actual hell? This is actually crazy, like, I'm in Thailand. This is mad. Right, I need a shower, that is what I need to do. Um, God, it's so hot out there. Yeah, I need, oh God, I don't know how to lock this door. There we go. I need a shower, I need to connect my phone to the Wi-Fi because I then need to download like an eSIM on my, uh, on my phone so that I can use my phone. So that is my first port of call. And then I need to message, oh God, I've got 16 WhatsApp notifications. This is mental. I'm so freaking excited. <laughs> right, I will speak to you very soon. Ah, what a good flat up. That toothpaste tastes rank. Is it? I've got a big cube there, use away. Thank you, yeah, I've got, I've got about three somewhere. Say hi to my roomie. We're just getting ready. And then we're gonna go out for some dins and we're gonna meet the other girls. How many of the others have you met? So I've met two last Two night. others. And then I've met two others. So we've got now like, how many? One, two, three, four. One's five, the same. Six. There's 13 of us <laughs> in total. Um, What was it, Hannah, is that what she's called? Yeah, Hannah said that you could have up to 20 on a trip. Which I think would be a bit too many. Yeah. Yeah, I think that would be a bit much. Right, we're ready to go out. We've just gone very casual outfits. We've also got. Are you doing an show you, Yeah, I am gonna. I'm gonna show you guys these. I got these on Amazon. I mean, I'll let you know if they work or not, but they're little like insect repellent bands. We've put them around our ankles. Creative, right? So hopefully we don't get bit, but we are gonna go to 7 Eleven because I'm gonna get that. Have you seen the one on TikTok? It's in like a pink, pink bottle. Bit of. Yeah, I'm gonna try and buy that. Um, because tomorrow night we are staying on a lake and we're bound to get bitten. So we need to be protected because we don't want none of that dengue fever. Um, but right, we're gonna go up to Dins now. I don't know where we're gonna go. Let's have a look. Oh, it's actually getting dark. Have we got the sunset yet? I think the sunset's been and gone. It's literally, when did it get so dark? I almost pitch black. It does look very, very stunning. Look at that. We're gonna go and meet the rest of the girls and we're gonna go have dinner, maybe some more beers. See where that takes up us. up nice and early. Up nice and early, yeah, very bright and early. We've got to get up at, I 
we're leaving at eight. Leaving at eight. So up bright and early. And we've got to pack up all our stuff. I've literally just got a big pile of crap on the floor right now. So, right, key card. Have I got a key card? I think we should probably both have one, shouldn't we? Your phone can be called. My phone maybe can make up another, right? So everything is good. You can be tried. Good morning, everyone. I don't know if you can hear me. So we've come down for breakfast. I didn't really vlog much last night because we were so tired. We're trying dragon fruit first time. But yeah, we've got some breakfast, we've got some fruit, we've got some toast. And this morning, we're heading, I look like Justin Bieber. <laughs> got a little coffee, nice. Oh, it's very frothy. Yeah, it's like a fun machine. Mm. Um, yes, yeah, so we're just having a bit of breakfast and then we are heading off to Cow Sock National Park. Um, we're not gonna have any signal or anything, so it's gonna be a fun experience, but it's a four hour bus journey. Parents are wrecky. Neither of us slept very well, we kept waking up. I think deep down we were just excited. I think it's like in a child, like Tuesday. Mm. And there was a lot going on, it was very noisy. Um, but yeah, I will speak to you at some point later on. chafing oh I can feel it oh my god I can really feel it moving oh that makes me feel a bit seasick I can literally <laughs> do you want me to open it you're right there just getting my swim up there <laughs> showed you guys much of where we're staying at Kalsok National Park so I thought I would quickly do a little video. Everyone is like chilling the other side of the bungalows and it is honestly so cute but I thought I would do a little tour um, of like where we're staying and stuff just in case you want to know what it looks like. It is honestly like the most beautiful place ever. Um, so this is like the back of all of the bungalows where we're staying. This is mine and alice's one we've made a bit of a mess not gonna lie we've got all of our stuff there and then we've got our beds here and then you literally walk out here and this is the lake everyone's chilling on their balconies can't really see it the lighting's not very good um yeah so this is our room and then you go out the back bit and this is more of the lake and then over here you've got a little block which has like toilets and stuff in it and then you follow these all the way down um, and then basically over there there's like the restaurant and stuff but I'll show you guys that later. We're just island girls. <laughs> We're not wearing any shoes. <laughs> Woo! We're not wearing any shoes guys. We're gonna go out for dinner now. I'm really not hungry at all. Um, Alice is just brushing her teeth. The lake. <laughs> I really feel like I should rush mine, but I won't want to eat afterwards. We have literally been chilling all afternoon. It's been so nice. Well, we actually got here quite late in the end. We've been chilling for like the last two hours on our little balcony. The sun has set now, though. It's fully gone. Um, but we've just been chilling. We had a little beer on our little terrace and we've been swimming, we went kayaking which was fun and now we've just very quickly got ready, I've just got a little Primark top on and a little little skirt, do you know what, guess how much this skirt cost? I feel like because you've said that it's going to be like It was quick. such a bargain. I love it. When you Six like, pounds. Where from? New look sale. Yeah, I literally was I like I want... wouldn't ever go for new no, look. No neither would I but I wanted like a long skirt for this exact trip and I found it in new look sale so Oh, where's our key? Oh, hello everyone. Coming for dinner. Yeah. <laughs> hello. 
so yeah it's quite a long walk along um, we're gonna have some dinner I don't know what we're gonna have we had a nice lunch earlier but I feel like the dinner's probably gonna be the same kind of food we had like a veggie curry and rice and some other bits and bobs but it was really good we're gonna get a nice cold drink and yeah oh yeah I didn't show you the lunch actually because I didn't bring my camera we had a watermelon smoothie and then a vegetarian curry it was really good What did we eat What's his name? Uh, what's yeah, your name? Blue. <laughs> Where did I get blue from? Because I said it looks oh, yeah. like a bear. <laughs> I know I don't want rice. <laughs> I think my camera's about to die. Hey everyone, good morning. It is almost 10. We're about to check out of the floating bungalows. Um, I'm very sad to go. I feel like we've only been here for 10 minutes. But we're just packing up our stuff, so I thought I would show you guys one last little view. We've been chilling out here most of the morning, had a bit of breakfast, but we're saying goodbye now. We are about to get on a little speedboat that takes us from here back to like the mainland bit which takes like half an hour and then we've got I think it's like a three hour coach journey um and then we're heading to where are we going Rayleigh or is that the beach that's the beach Rayleigh beach which Rayleigh is beach. Crabby. Crabby I don't know if Crabby's an island I feel like we'll look on a map oh, we've got so yeah I don't know I mean surely it, mm, do you reckon we then have to get a bus and then another boat we're that's getting on a speedboat I think I think another so because we had our long tail boat yesterday, now mm. we've got a speed boat. Oh, I just called that one a speed boat. That's not a speed long boat. Long tail boat. Long tail so that's boat. That's like the traditional Thai boat. I don't know the difference. Mm. But um, with, yeah. our, with our life jackets. Oh, sexy life jackets. But yeah, my camera's about to die. So we won't be able to charge it until I get back um, and, and until we check into the next hotel. But yeah, I thought I would give you one last little view, say bye, and I will chat to you when we get back to the mainland. I look like I'm naked in this top. Hey everyone, this is a really weird angle. Um, I thought I would do a little update because I actually haven't filmed all day. I haven't filmed anything since this morning. Um, but we've travelled to, where are we, Crabby? Crabby? Rayleigh Beach, Crabby. Crabby, Rayleigh Beach, which is in Crabby. In Crabby. Yeah. Is Crabby an island? I don't know. We really should it's know mainland. this. I thought it was island. Okay, so we're in a place called Crabby and we're at... Rayleigh Beach, we haven't actually been down to the beach yet, but we got a coach here and then we got on a boat. I'm not gonna lie, that boat was really choppy. I felt a bit sick on that the second. I was thriving on that boat. Yeah, you like boats so you're good on boats. I was literally sat there like, it was so bumpy. Um, but anyway, we're here now. We've been chilling by the pool pretty much all afternoon. Um, and it has been hot, but I feel like, I don't think I'm gonna get a tan at Auburn while we're away. Cause it's not like, it's not like sunny, it's just hot. And I know you can still burn and like get a tan through the clouds, but I don't know, it just really wasn't, I don't feel like we were gonna burn or get a tan. So yeah, we've been chilling by the pool, had a few beers and now we've come back, got ready. I'll show you guys my outfit. It's probably the nicest outfit I've worn the whole time I've been here. Um, got a little white linen trousers. I'm having to wear my trainers because I've got awful blisters on my feet like they're really bad for my crocs so i can't wear them anymore and then i've got this little like green boob tube top we've got very greasy hair so we've um just scraped it back i was gonna wash it but i thought i'm just gonna wait another day like i've only actually been here for three days so leave it a bit longer i've scraped it back put a bit of makeup on which feels nice and yeah we're heading out for dinner i don't know where we're going i think he did put it on the whatsapp didn't he but i actually haven't looked at it quickly very quickly give you a little room tour i'm gonna Go from outside. It's still very hot, like very hot. We've showered, but I'm sweating. So it's very pretty. This is what our surroundings look like. So we have to come down. There's a massive hill, literally down here. This is the building. It's very, very pretty. And then we are in this little room, me and Alice. You can literally see straight in it through there. So we need to remember to close those curtains later. Um, we've got a bed here. We've got a little like desk and like fridge and stuff, little wardrobe and then really cute balcony out here. You're not gonna be able to see much because it's pretty much pitch black now, but looks like this and it's literally in the jungle, but we've got a massive, massive balcony. Yeah, we need to keep the doors closed because there's a lot of mosquitoes and apparently monkeys 
around here as well. We are yet to see one, but some of the other girls have seen a monkey. Okay. Flashed or flushed out. Okay. Ooh, look at this. Ooh. to hear me um it's actually not really the morning anymore but we've been so busy today it's so windy out there i actually can't stay out there um we've been very busy this morning we've been up we had breakfast which was lovely um i'm gonna take you guys along to breakfast tomorrow and show you it in the hotel because it was actually really nice um and then we went and did some sea kayaking which was fun we were out for like an hour and then we kayaked to like a cute little beach and then we chilled on the beach for a bit We've come back, we've showered, we've re-sun creamed um, and now we're going to go get some food, I think. I've put on a little swimming costume rather than a bikini because I just thought we're going rock climbing um, in a bit so I didn't really want to have a bikini on. I want something like carby and filling because I feel like I am really hungry. Um, but yeah, just having a little Coke. They didn't have diets so and full fat, which I don't actually really like the taste of. But I needed something sugary and something cold. I don't know how well you're going to be able to hear me because it's very windy and we've got like a generator on our balcony so you probably can't actually hear me um I don't think we've filmed oh my god there's a monkey can you see that oh I don't think you can see oh my god oh my god Harry um anyway yeah so we went rock climbing I had a bit of a meltdown before I did it because I sat and watched everyone else do it first and then I just panicked and I started crying and I was like, I don't want to do it. But I did, made myself do it in the end. Um, and then, yeah, we walked home, we went and got snacks and one of the girls, literally, a monkey, jumped on her and tried to take her snacks. So we had to take a longer route home because we literally couldn't walk past them. Um, but yeah, we've just got back. I've just like had a quick shower off, put a different bikini on and we're going to go chill by the pool. <laughs> Good evening everyone. I actually don't think I've vlogged much at all today. Um, but it's now the evening. It is what time is it? 20 past seven. We're actually meant to be meeting the girls at quarter past seven, so we're running slightly late. Sorry girls, if so you're girls, watching this. Sorry girls if you're watching this vlog. <laughs> you've said we're rushing you I know. away. <laughs> we're just chilling, having a beer in the room. Um, but yeah, we've spent the afternoon literally just by the pool. Alice went and got a massage mm. and I'm very jealous. So I got I think... a little, I got my feet rubbed in the vlog. and I just feel like I would never think to have my feet rubbed, but it was so good. I love that. I'm definitely going to get a massage at some point. Mm. I think we do get one included. We do, but I almost yeah. feel like tomorrow we've got a bit of time between getting, in the morning. between check out and getting the boat. Yeah, we'll go get like a little mm. coffee or a smoothie and then go get massage. Oh, we've seen, because we've just spotted oat milk mm. coffee as well. Oh yeah, Which I don't know. I feel where, like yeah, yeah, is yeah. something we need. You said about that to me. I still don't know where it is. Um, but yes, we are about to go out for the evening. We're going to go get some food. I actually don't feel hungry. I'm not going to lie. But this is every night we go. We're not hungry. We're not hungry. And then we get there. We're not. We eat. We're not that hungry. And then we yeah. get into bed. And we're like Although starving. To, yeah, to be fair, last night I didn't really eat that much actually. We weren't mm. sat anywhere near each other at dinner last night, which mm. was sad. It's it's so weird. Like so, there's like thirteen of us on this trip and. Like everyone gets on so well, but it's like, and we were just looking at like pictures, and we were like, I yeah. can't believe that was like five days ago. Yeah, we didn't like know we've only known each other for what? yeah, like four or five days. That's mad. That is crazy. It's madness. But yeah, so we like go out for dinner, and obviously there's a lot of us who end up sitting with like different people. And yeah, last night we weren't sat anywhere near each other, but I had my pizza, and I was like, oh, I'm not really hungry. And then I got home, and I was starving. Yeah. 
We had to look up the hotel breakfast. Yeah. Oh, it was good actually. I'm going to take... It was. I'll take you guys along tomorrow mm. morning and show you the breakfast. Cause that'll oh, be... we'll try an omelette in the morning. Are you? A little fresh omelette. Mm. Yeah, because that's that'll be our last... Tonight is our last night here, so tomorrow will be our last breakfast. Um, but yeah, so after like doing the rock climbing and stuff, we've literally been back. You went and got a massage. I chilled by the pool. And that's kind of it. Now we're going to go out for dins. Mm. I don't know where we're going. We actually don't have a plan, do we? No. I think the tour guide... You little suggestions. Do you not come with us, is it? No. I wonder if Max will watch this. Yeah. Hey, Max. Hi, Max. Watching. <laughs> I'm going to send it in the WhatsApp <laughs> group so you can watch it. <laughs> Basically, we've got a tour guide with us, which I'm actually so thankful for. Mm. And I was saying to my mum, like, he is so nice. He's so chill. He's obviously from around here, so he can, like, speak the language. Like, makes it so much easier. And he's just, like, he's a nice guy as well. Like, oh it's gosh, not even, like, I'm actually like, part of the I'm group. sad that he's not coming yeah. to dinner with us. Like, he's so nice. Mm. Like, he's so chilled. And like we've become really good friends of him, so yeah. He's it's well, he's been... in the room next door. So you I know. Hear this? Hi, Max. We love you. <laughs> um, but yeah, we're gonna finish our beers and we're gonna go for dinner. I'll take you guys with me. I think how much battery have I got? Yeah, I've got full battery. Last so long. Mm. I only had to charge it once. Um, but yeah, we're gonna go for dinner and. And then tomorrow we've just got a little boat trip to our next spot. Yeah. See where the night takes us. I think we're gonna try and have a little bit of a chilled one because mm. we have got to be up. Not early, not early but, but I just feel like we've not properly slept. No, neither of us have slept like, at all. I, I, mean, had a, I actually had a good, really good sleep last night. Really good sleep. Are they outside? Are they? Hearing us. Oh, they're texting. <laughs> oh no, that's my mum. Are they girls outside? <laughs> no, they're not. Oh my god, it's so hot. It's really humid out there. Just. everyone <laughs> look at my hair oh my god i'm a state like an actual state i haven't filmed anything all day today and we're just gonna have today as a write-off um but i woke up this morning and i was really poorly i've had like an awful upset stomach and then i was sick and then it was literally the worst timing possible because we then had to get on a boat to get to where we are now which is um pp island so yeah it was honestly horrible like it took all of my strength to not throw up on the boat it was so bumpy and so choppy we were on it for like a good 45 minutes um <laughs> so yeah i don't feel good at all yeah we've got to our next hotel honestly i was so spaced out and like concentrating on trying not to throw up when we got here that we've literally checked into our room and I just didn't pay any attention. I couldn't even tell you what the hotel's called. Couldn't tell you what it looks like. Can't remember what reception looks like. Like I literally just came up to the room, got into bed and have been sleeping ever since. And it's now like half six. Um, Alice has gone out. They've all gone out on like a um, viewpoint hike to see the sunset, which I'm very jealous of. And I'm so upset that I haven't gone, but I don't have the strength or the energy to do that, so I've literally just been sleeping the whole time. That's my update. I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna get ready. We're gonna go out for food tonight. I'm gonna make myself go, even though I really don't want to. And I'm just gonna try and eat something really, really plain. And then I'll probably come straight back to the hotel. So I'm not gonna take my camera. We're writing off today. Good morning, guys. It is now the next day. Um, yeah, I didn't vlog anything yesterday because I was feeling really, really ill. I feel better today, but I have still got a really awful stomach. So today's gonna be interesting because we're doing a boat trip where we literally go out on a boat and we're out on the boat all day. So I'm assuming it hasn't got toilet. So that's gonna be interesting. So we've taken some medicine to hopefully stop me from being ill. Um, but I do feel better in myself. I feel like I've got more energy now I've slept and stuff, but yeah, I still don't really feel 100%. 
but just gotta get on with it so i've put on a bikini i'm gonna put on a white shirt over the top and yeah we're gonna go on our little boat trip alice is just out having a wander at the moment and um, we're meeting up in about an hour all of the girls and then we're getting on the boat and then yeah we're gonna be out on the boat all day so i will take you along <laughs> Yeah, so you can jump on the phone? Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god, they're right there. Yeah, you can leave your stuff on the phone, don't worry. Oh my god. Look at it. Oh, I wasn't filming. Do it again. Do it again. <laughs> I'm ready to go out for dinner my hair is not a vibe tonight but look how curly it is it's got so much seawater and stuff in it but i decided not to wash it um but yeah we've been out all day on the boat we had a really good day and now we're about to go out for dinner i think we're going to an indian restaurant um so yeah i do feel better i've still got a bit of a tummy ache but i think i'm all right um i'm just drinking loads of water and yeah this is our last night in the place we're staying in pp and then tomorrow we're heading back to Phuket and having two more nights there I think so yeah that is the plan um but yeah going out for dinner might have a little wander afterwards I think maybe there's talk of like going to a fire show so I had to come back early <laughs> literally sat down to eat food I ordered my dinner I ate like a few mouthfuls of it and then I was like no my stomach hurts so much so I came back to the room and I've taken my makeup off and I've got into my PJs and I've just done like a little bit of sorting with my stuff because um, everything had got a bit messy. And somehow I've lost two pairs of shorts, which is really annoying. I've lost my like sports cycling shorts and I've lost my pajama shorts. Uh, I'm just gonna get an early night and hope that when I wake up tomorrow, I feel better. I don't actually feel ill, like I don't feel poorly, so it's fine. I've just got an awful stomach, so fingers crossed it stops tomorrow because we've got to get another boat tomorrow we've got to get a two hour boat hi everyone i have been awful at vlogging today i haven't filmed at all um i literally haven't filmed anything since last night i've still not been feeling great like i feel better but i actually feel ill within myself but i've still just got such a bad stomach so I've not been feeling good so I haven't really wanted to film anything today um we've not really been doing anything interesting it's just been like another traveling day which I feel like when we're traveling I never really have anything to film um we've literally just been on a ferry and then a bus and now we've arrived back in Phuket which is where we started the trip and we're back at the exact same hotel me and Alice are in the same room but like switched around the other way um and we've got a cute little balcony again with a different view so I'll show you that in a sec but yeah, we've got today and then we've got tomorrow and then that's literally the tour over. It's gone so quick, but also I feel like I've been here for so long and I think being poorly has just like made it really weird. Like I feel like I haven't eaten properly the last few days. I feel like I haven't fully enjoyed it as much as possible because like I've not been going out and doing much because I've just felt like shit. But anyway, we're gonna manifest that I feel better soon. Um, I'm just trying to drink as much water as possible because I haven't really been eating much. I literally had some crisps and a little like banana muffin and that's all I've eaten today. So we're all going as a group and we're all going to go and get a massage. So I will let you know what that's like. I will not be taking my camera because I doubt that is the sort of thing I can be filming. Um, but I'll let you know later how it is. 
and then I think yeah out for dinner and stuff tonight but I will try and take you along because I've been rubbish the last few days. View from the balcony because it's different to the last time. So last time we had a pool view and this time we've got like more of a city view. I mean it is kind of similar. There's just so much to look at like it's crazy and then there's the beach over there which I haven't actually been to this beach. Place your hand on my beating heart. Good evening, everyone. We are back from our little evening out. Um, I don't think I film much, which I keep saying all the time at the moment, but um, we went and got massages. I wasn't gonna get one because I was feeling really poorly earlier. Like I went down to the pool for a bit and chilled. And then I suddenly felt really ill again. So I came back to the room and lied down. Um, and then, yeah, we all went and got a massage. I wasn't gonna do it because I was like, I don't wanna feel ill in the middle of a massage, but I did it and it was actually so nice. Um, it's definitely an experience to say the least, but it was really, really good. Um, so yeah, we went and did that and then we went straight and got some food. I knew I needed to eat, but I literally was like, I'm just not feeling any food. Um, and then we discovered a McDonald's. So we got McDonald's and I got some curly fries and it was actually just what I needed. It was delicious and I feel better for eating i've still got a stomach ache like the pains in my stomach are bad we went to this like shopping mall it was actually massive and i could have spent hours in there it was really really fun we went to like a little pharmacy shop thing like beauty shop and i got a few bits so i thought i'd quickly show you um i got this orange lip balm because i thought it looked cute and i've lost my lip balm so i thought i'd get this one oh actually doesn't smell of anything maybe it tastes a bit no, it does not. It's, um, a little eye map, eye eye matches. No, eye masks, which I actually might do now. They're like little gold collagen eye masks. And then we went to a Seven Eleven to get some snacky bits. I got some dried mango because I feel like all I've been eating the last few days is literally like carbs. So I got that. Um. Oh, I also got this in the um beauty shop. It's like a SPF thirty powder so I can put it in my hairline I thought that'd be cool even though I've only literally got one day left but whatever it was so cheap um I got some little chocolate wafers and then I got my all-time favorite snack which my friend Amber told me to try these when I came to Thailand and I'm not joking I've probably eaten one every single day um they are these little banana cupcakes you get them in 7-eleven they're like 30 baht or maybe even cheaper than that and they are so delicious so highly recommend if you come to Thailand to try them um, and then the last thing I picked up were these that I saw. I don't know what if this is going to help or do anything. But this is a um, heat patch. I think predominantly for period pain. But I thought stomach pain. So I'm going to give it a go. I'm actually... It actually doesn't hurt too much right now. So I might not do it now. We've got our eye masks on. They're not quite what we thought. Because I think I look like a bit of a... I can't work out if it's super... It's super does it look like I've got pop art? Yes. It doesn't the real. This looks like, it's a, like a snapchat, like a filter. snapchat filled. Oh my god, it does. And the way it's peeling off looks like a. <laughs> and then yours are burning. Mine are really, really burning my skin. And then I just said to Alice, I wonder if they've got like bleaching stuff in them. Because a lot of the skincare in Thailand has like bleaching agents in them. I'll probably wake up with a rash all over my face Imagine. tonight. Just another problem to add to my agenda. Ooh, they feel like springy as well. They feel nice, but they're really stinging. Mm. So I'm going to take them off. I'm going to brush my teeth. So we are up bright and early and we're going to see the elephants. So I'm gonna take you guys along with me. Also guys, look how cool the view from our lift is in our hotel. So pretty. <laughs> Grass, fiber, okay, fiber plant, bamboo, poultry, coconut, okay. 
<laughs> it's okay. Hey! <laughs> I will. <laughs> no, jump right over here. Oh my god. My lunch. Okay, Try to take my camera. You want to be in the vlog? <laughs> Say, Swadi <laughs> Hello, I'm back in the room. Thought I would just do a very quick update. Well, I need to sort my hair out. And um, back from the elephant sanctuary, I had a really, really nice time. It was really cute, and it was very weird seeing real life elephants that close up it was very um surreal but anyway we're back now we're gonna go to 7-eleven because we need some food and a drink because i'm so thirsty i've got a bit of a headache so we've got a little 7-eleven haul i'm just gonna put this back uh, where can i put you put you up here so yeah just popped to 7-eleven to get some bits and i feel like i mostly bought liquids like i bought so many drinks um, but I've been wanting to try this one for ages and I have been able to find it and I finally found it. It's called Pacari Sweat. I don't know what it is. It's basically, I think, I think like an electrolyte drink. And I saw someone on TikTok say that if you have like a hangover or like a bad stomach, you need to drink this. So I found it. So I'm drinking this because I do feel very dehydrated. Um, so yeah, I got that. And then I also got a big bottle of water. And I got this little cute drink, which I actually bought one of these on like the, one of the first days here. And then it got really warm in my bag, so I didn't drink it. So I've got a new one. It's like a light cheap aloe vera drink, I think. And this was honestly so cheap. And then I thought I'd better get some actual lunch as well. So I picked up one of the um, cheese toasties, which I'm very excited for. Just having a quick snack after my nap. I woke up from my nap and I actually think I feel quite good. I still feel tired, but I'm having a quick snack and then we're literally about to head off now to go to a big temple, a big Buddha. I'm not really sure what it is, but I'm gonna take you with me. Just arrived at the big Buddha. It's very big. Wowie! Put your hands up! There's like a bit more of like a breakdown then. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. You were doing that a little bit, weren't you? I know, I just saw that. <laughs> and open the final hotel beer of the trip. We've got a tan, got the tunes on. Cheers! Yeah, stunning. Hello, this is Alice Cam. So, I just an update for you that I am going to be taking over the vlog for the evening. Um, I've never done this before, so be patient and I will let you know how the evening goes. Hello, um, would everyone like to introduce themselves? You already know me. Hi, I'm Beth. <laughs> Hi, I'm Casey. <laughs> Hi, I'm Morgan. Hi, I'm Ellen. Hi, I'm Jess. Hi, I'm Hannah. Hi, I'm Charlotte. You can do that oh, so you can see. Oh, there we go. <laughs> you have to introduce yourself to the vlog. Uh, I'm Max. <laughs> so, so, we have all know. just outside oh, the yeah, hotel I now. I I'll give you a shot of the... Where are we staying? What's it called? Royal, Royal Paradise, Paradise Hotel. Highly recommend. And we are off out for dinner. Just a bit of tip for you all. Um, if you are buying sun cream as pictured here, um, the 
when you are in Thailand, you should bring your own sun cream, shouldn't you, Jess? Yeah, you should because we've Jess has been spending. We've... How much have you spent on sun about, cream? Probably about fifty quid on sun cream. Yeah, because the normal non like, yeah, like English the brands yeah. are like skin bleach in them, I think. Yeah. Uh, so bring your own sun cream. Yeah. So for dinner, we're at a place yeah, they're, 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 called so like Naughty Nori's. Same bill, kind of. Just gonna turn the camera around. What are you gonna order, Charlotte? I'm gonna order some chips and some corny food. What are you gonna order? Well, I think I'm gonna find out if they can make me a nasi goreng, which currently has pork without the pork. So we'll see how that goes. So um, we're just here, and I'll give you a little pan around. <laughs> We're just in 7 Eleven, so I thought I'd give you a little any of the snacks we've got. So I'm getting a block peanut bar and a bottle of water, which is 14 baht, which is quite a good deal for a big bottle. But I'll give you a little tour. I'll just switch the camera around. All of these, where are some of the good kits? Let me show you these muffins. So we've got these banana cupcakes, they're so good. So we've been eating a lot of them. Got the shit ones as well. We've got all of these snacks. There's sushi, there's, there's everything you could want. I won't show you the whole store, but it's all very good value. So today I had some little bits of sushi and also some cucumber. And they do toasties. So yeah, I think everyone's getting what are you getting from 7 Eleven? Some chocolate, vinegar, water, the iconic and cakes. cakes. I've, I've just shown, I've just shown all the viewers the cakes. <laughs> Only nice water to drink. Nice water, and then everyone's waiting outside. <laughs> So we have our room here, and then always next door seem to be our little room buddies. Hi! Hi! Hi, girlies! Hi, nice, 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 sweet dreams! Good night! Good night! Good night! Good night! Hello, so we are just reporting in final night. Um, we've actually been quite boring. But what? Well, we stayed out till like half eleven. It's later um, than it feels. It feels like quite early, I don't even feel tired, but it's actually quite late. Oh god, an on cue yawn! We've just had a quite a hectic day. Um, you've got a long flight tomorrow. Going home tomorrow, guys. So okay. we've just had, we stopped off at 7-Eleven, come back, had a bit of a chat. We all bought a water and a banana muffin. <laughs> Which is a classic. Did you yeah. buy a muffin? No. no, I actually got out, I showed, I showed the vlog. I already um, showed them. I bought a little peanut bar. Oh yeah, cute, you like bar. them. And then just chilled. Um, it's quite weird that this is our final night. I'm so tired. I'm so tired. This is not mm. this Yeah, this isn't is very our, good content. This is it? isn't very good content. No, no, it's fine. Yeah, this is our oh, final night. Oh, I'm wearing night. my new um, tourist t shirt. That's from cute. The PP Islands. PP Islands. But we're off to bed now, so good night, sweet dreams. Mm. It's our last toothbrushing session. So it's bright and early and we've decided to go and have one final little sunbathe together because today is the day that I go home. I'm not going home till like this evening though, so it's all good. We don't have to check out till 12. So we're gonna go and do a little sunbathe, go and have breakfast and then sort out this mess. Gotta be rewarded for the little things in life sometimes. 
can't see anything. We're just having a little sunbathe. We managed to get these like cabanas. Yeah, little canopy bed things. And it is absolutely bloody boiling already. <laughs> Carry on. <laughs> Guys, we're all packed up. I'm very sad. I've already had a little cry this morning. We went to breakfast and we said goodbye to Max, which is our tour guide. And we gave him a hug and I literally just started crying. And I feel like now I've started, I'm not gonna be able to stop. Like saying goodbye to everyone is gonna be so sad. But anyway, we don't have to, well, we don't have to check out till 12. It's, what time is it? It's like 11? 11. Yeah, 10 past 11. But we're gonna go and check out, leave our stuff downstairs because we're all packed up. And then we're gonna go to like a beauty salon. I'm gonna get my nails done because they look gross. And potentially a massage. I'm not sure, I'm very undecided whether that's a good idea because then I'm gonna have like oil and stuff on me. But Alice is gonna get a massage. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go do that now. So I'll take you along, but do the view one last time. I've just sat out here and taken it all in. Very sad to be leaving. Hello everyone, so we're just outside a 7-Eleven. We went and got our, well, I got a little manicure. I just went for like a nudie colour. Um, Alice got head, shoulder and neck massage, which she thoroughly enjoyed. And then we've been for a little wonder, but we're having a little break in the shade. Um, and we've come to 7-Eleven to get some lunch. I have, of course, gone for cheese toasty. And then we've got some snacks. I've also done a bit of shopping and I've got a few bits because I hadn't bought like any presents or anything the whole time I was here. So I panicked and got a few last minute. Um, but yeah, we're just gonna sit and chill. My card got declined, which was annoying because I was trying to save my cash. So Alice had to pay. So now we've got to sort that out and the receipt is in Thai, so it's all very confusing. But um, yeah, let's eat.